Today we are making lamb pasta. Hello everyone, welcome back to Kiri Australia. We just released our 1000 subscriber special. Check it out in the description and hopefully we get more views on this video. Today we are making pasta lamb. It's a combination of pasta and lamb with a new creamy saucy recipe. So let's begin. We have Chef Bidanja today with today's ingredients. Hello everyone, welcome back. So we are up for pasta and lamb today. So the ingredients for today are butter, pasta, minced lamb, capsicum, onions, pasta sauce, cheese slices, red chili powder, peri peri powder, thickened cream, milk, mayonnaise, black pepper, mixed herbs, ginger garlic paste, and oil. So let's get started. All right, we're washing our hands and we're grabbing uh, the lamb mince. Now we're gonna uh, put it onto, we're gonna cut it open and put it onto a chopping board. And all we're gonna do is we're going to be cutting them up into some uh, meatballs and then just chucking them into another bowl. Just take a few moments. This is a brand new recipe. Um, it's an Indian slash Italian recipe, which is something new. And uh, I hope we you in enjoy this recipe. Now that's all our lamb all done. Now we're gonna grab our oil and put one to two tablespoons of oil. Spread that all around. Grab your mixed herbs. Tap and some peri peri rub. You can have um, the hotness you can of the level you can choose our red chili powder that's a hundred percent up to you as always ginger garlic paste one to two tablespoons you can see that we have black pepper a little bit you can see that we finally have the ginger garlic paste together some chicken salt also add now that's basically it just uh, put that all together into one big bowl now you're gonna spray your uh, places for the oven with some olive oil, canola oil and you're going to make them into balls and just place them in there very simple you're almost done with this one and that's all ready just spray them out with another a batch of olive oil and just put that into the oven 180 degrees 200 degrees for about 15 20 minutes now grab your pasta and that uh, pot i'm gonna add some water about two, one half to three quarter full leave that to simmer there for about 20 30 minutes now we're gonna grab our onions and cut them up we're gonna be making them into thinly sliced julienne forms and then into just finely chopped um, square shapes looking good now that's all we just put that to the side and um, then we're gonna be putting our capsicum you can choose the color of your capsicum red or green doesn't oh bell pepper also works anything that looks resembles uh, the from the capsicum family now just chop those up and also finely chop the pieces as like with the onion put that to the side too look at our meatballs uh, all ready now almost ready and uh, we're gonna be putting some olive oil or oil whatever you like just to let that fry for a couple of minutes put some black pepper salt so that up Now you're going to grab your butter and you're going to put one tablespoon If you want it low fat, it, I would recommend low fat um, because you'll be putting a lot of butter I'm going to grab your milk About one cup of milk to half a cup That's totally up to you If you want a more a homogeneous mixture, you can add also add some thickened cream And then next you're going to be adding some mayonnaise one tablespoon of mayonnaise that's it then uh, you're gonna add some cheese in the middle let that uh, soften and melt and grab some pizza based sauce and just spread that all in 
some red chili powder, or paprika. Then put your pasta in that's already, and your meatballs, add some black pepper. And again, with some mixed herbs, some salt, stir that all up. You can put your cheese there to melt, to looking good. good. And we're gonna add our meatballs. We're almost done with this recipe. That's basically it. Thanks so much for watching.